Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red. In the last part, we defeated Dave in on route this route near Viridian City, and we defeated Giovanni, our so-called father, people believe. Also, off-screen since the last part, I've grinded and grinded all our five Pokemon up to level 50. Uh, big changes. I'll quickly just go through my moves. So I got Thunderbolt on him now, just he learned at level 47. I give uh, Dragonair Blizzard, I think I did show you that, and that was it on him. Poison Fang got learned by Greeny, and I changed that for. What did I have there? I had something that I didn't use a lot. No, Bite. I changed it for Bite, because I didn't really use Bite, so I took Poison Fang instead. Uh, nothing changed with Rex. Paul learnt Surf because I kind of changed his moves so he has a good uh, type attack, but like uh, large attack type. So I got bored of horn, uh, horn attack, so I give him Surf because it looks cooler. And yeah, we got Dodo. So you're probably thinking, why haven't I picked up a six Pokemon yet? Well, I've decided not to pick a six Pokemon up yet because I know which one I'm going to catch and I can't catch him yet. So I will catch him last. So we're going to be heading into the... Uh, what's this place called? So this is like Victory Road I believe. You just need to handle all your badges then. So the Boulder Badge from Brock. The Cascade Badge from Misty. I don't think you need... To, oh, I think I'm okay. And the Thunder Badge from LT Surge or Lieutenant Surge. The rainbow badge from Erica. So we've got a surf now. I think you can find like uh, side ducks and stuff here. Soul badge from uh, Koga, I believe, or maybe Sabrina. And we get a Pokemon, typical. Psyduck. And Psyduck's de dealt with. And the marsh badge from. No, Soul Badge was from Koga, Marsh Badge from Sabrina, I think that's right. And we're slowly getting here. I believe all you can find here is Spearows and Theros. Spearows and Theros, quite high level actually. How much experience? Uh, 900, that ain't too bad. Only pass here, Volcano Badge from Blaine. Yep, so that's that bit done. And we got one more badge to give in, which I don't want to go up there, nothing there. Okay, so this guy, you can only pass through Earth Badge, which was from Giovanni, which we just fought the last episode. Right, go ahead. And here we are, outside of Victory Road Gate, approximately. So this is Victory Cave, I believe. Oh, it's called Victory Road, actually, considering it's a cave. Okay. So I do have a um, cleanse tag out, so I'm hoping that's going to... Wait, uh, who's got the cleanse tag? Dragonair's got it. So if I put Dragonair in first position, this should stop wild Pokemon, it says. I don't know if it stops them or only allows strong Pokemon, like high level Pokemon to battle us, but we'll find out. So firstly, you want to start pushing this boulder about. So just follow I could speed this up, I suppose. No, because I'm... If you speed it up when you're uh, pushing boulders, you're going to do it wrong, you got to start again. So it's just easier to walk about. So you want to push this one in here, which I opened the way up on the high ground, and what have we got here then? A Marowak. Level 44, so I think it, the cleanse tag only gives us strong Pokemon in this area. So Surf. Wait, I need to speed this up soon at White Bow. Wow, we didn't die. No, we didn't. Okay, so let's get going. Okay, the cleanse tag's not really working. I thought the cleanse tag was going to work. Okay, anyways, I'm going to use a Max Repel. So we'll fight this lady. Rapidash. Bull Picks. Let me guess, Ninetales? Yep. And Ninetales. Oh, didn't die. I think we can kill it with a slam. Yeah. So 
there's some Pokeballs up there. I'm not really too bothered, I don't think. I don't think there's anything interesting. Go! Go, Ash! Walk! No, Chazzy Bee. Not bloody Ash. But look at the picture. It's just whenever you look at him, you're just like, wow, look at her. Ow, super fang. There you go, he's dead. Ivysaur. So I wonder how much damage Poison Fang does. No, not that much. Wow, Hyper Potion, what a dick. Lol, you're dead. What did it, I didn't see what it said. Um, let's go pull, just to make sure. Surf! Surf! Double kick! So, slowly making my way downtown, walking fast. Patient, face, hello, how about? What's that white chick? So, who knows? I don't know why I started singing that song. Don't ask me why. So, this boulder wants to be pushed in this here, so let's do that. Can't remember if you need to do it, but. Mm. Ah, bloody Kung Fu man. So we need surf. The chop. Go to greeny. You should be able to kill these. And Machoke is down. Black Belt David Mitchell is dead. So we're gonna go over here and steal this Pokeball. Sand Storm. Mm, not very good. Well, that's okay. But yeah. So you want to go in here, and this is where you got push this boulder miles and miles. Also, all the trainers in there. I'm gonna miss some of them, and I'll come back to them later on. And I'll do some more training off screen. So that's what we've decided to do. Overheat. Really, the move overheat. Whenever I look at it, it just reminds me of Flannery, which is the gym leader on Ruby and Sapphire, which is like the fifth gym leader repel war. Okay, so I think I should have enough repels. So I've got some trainers here. I'll fight them. I'll do the fighting of them off screen because they're pretty boring and take a lot of time. So I don't know if this is the right way. I don't have a clue. Ah, here we go. This is where we've got to go. So I believe you drop down here. And then you push this boulder. Like so. And then you go in here. There's a double battle there. I'll fight a double battle. Why not, hey? So... Well, I seem to remember what they use. I think it's a Nido Queen and a Nido King. We're trying to become champions together. Or oh, your boyfriend and girlfriend. Wow, nice haircuts. Ha! <laughs> ha! <laughs> That's the same haircuts. Okay. So, we're gonna use. I shouldn't have used. I don't know, who cares? We're, we're, we're men. Thunderbolt. Good job. Oh, the ground type. Oh no! Why didn't I. I know that. I have a Nido King. Leave my Pikachu, not Pikachu alone. Crash. Alright. Swift's not too bad. It hits both of them. <laughs> and it can never miss. I think. I believe, believe that's correct. Okay, so flamethrower swift. It's not bad damage. Hopefully if we get a crit and the here die. Looking for a crit. Boy, he's not even a crit. Just killed him. Cool couple Ray and Trey. Day. Whatever. So that's them two done with, they were pretty simple, not gonna lie. So, dodge this trainer, and we are out of there. 
So that's V3 Road. I've done the quick route. There's some items in there which I'll pick up off screen while I train. And now you got a little puzzle. Which way do you go? This way. And then. Indigo Plateau. So you want to come straight in here. We're not going to be starting the Elite Four now. But you want to heal up. Because at least now you can fly here whenever you want. As soon as, I think that's as soon as you heal up. Maybe as soon as you come into the area. But So now we can fly here at any time. Indigo Plateau. So this is only going to be a short part. But this is just me getting through Victory, Ra Victory Road. Off screen I will be training these guys up to level f probably about 55 maybe a little bit higher I don't know I'll train up in Victory Road and then after that part we will see what we do next maybe challenge the Elite Four I'm not too sure but next time at Pokemon Fire Red we will be doing something until then Bizzle and BEEP